Alrighty, today let's learn about image classification. We'll be using computer vision for it. So I'll be giving you a brief idea what is computer vision and what can computer vision do. So computer vision includes capabilities like object detection, image classification, facial recognition and optical character recognition which is known as OCR and many others. So today we will be concerned about image classification. So what is image classification? Image classification is uh, nothing but in if we look at this image here I can find like uh, one human is there something like that here some eye is there brain is there something like that categorizing images like cat is there something like that cat dog those things are there. So that's how uh, today we'll be doing everything from the scratch the entire architecture diagram which you're uh, looking. Let's uh, dive into the Azure portal. Alrighty, I'm in the Azure portal. So we can search Azure AI service. If it is not there, you can type here Azure AI service and it should appear Azure AI service. So let's uh, click on it. And if you look here, we have computer vision. So Azure AI service contains many more things like AI search, custom vision. So we'll be covering all these things later in this hands-on uh, series. We'll be, uh, since this we are just getting started, let's first begin with computer vision, that is analyze content in images and videos it sees. So let's click on, click create button plus one. So now let's um, give one resource group name. So resource group is where our Azure resource will reside, that is the computer vision will uh, reside right next we have the region region is nothing but the geographical location where our uh, computer vision service will be there right this is a physical location we can select anything in any any place where we want uh, our uh, computer vision service to reside geographically or physically next we let's give a name for our computer vision so after giving the name let's select the pricing tier uh, let's select standard S1 for this demo. This should look good. And if we scroll down a bit, we have some responsible AI. Notice these things. I need to check mark this. Then click on review and create. Let's click on the magic button create here. Let's wait for a while till our deployment gets completed. It gets instantly completed. Uh, if we wait for a while, yeah, our deployment just got completed. So let's uh, go to the uh, resource. If we go to the resource, we are in the resource group level. So now in the resource uh, group, we'll be moving towards the computer vision. Let's go here. And uh, here uh, we need to get our uh, keys and endpoint because we'll be uh, needing this in the tutorial later on. So which we can uh, uh, find in the keys and endpoint, right? So keys and endpoints will be under the resource management uh, blade keys and endpoint please make sure you are in the computer vision we can uh, copy the keys uh, let's copy this I'll uh, paste in a uh, notepad I'll be requiring the key as well as the endpoint so let's copy the endpoint as well let's uh, paste this and keep it for future reference will be requiring in a while so for now let's uh, go to click here the this is nothing but the cloud shell and here we'll be using the partial there are two options bash and partial please note we'll be using partial because we'll be firing some commands here so now uh, we need to select the subscription let's select one of the subscription i'll be clicking uh, now the apply button let's click on apply so it's requesting cloud shell Let's wait for a while till it gets succeeded. Yeah, it got succeeded now. Looks good. Let's wait for the PowerShell to start. All right now, our PowerShell uh, is ready now. So now we'll be configuring and uh, running the client app, which will utilize the um, cognitive uh, services like the computer vision API, which will allow us to send images for analysis and extract whatever data is there like uh, in the picture if uh, uh, someone is uh, shopping in the market or uh, any kind of things are there uh, that's how uh, we'll be doing 
some image classification today right so uh, we have already uh, one uh, repository so here i'll be showing you the command this is nothing but get clone clone is like copying into the um, local like it's clone command and here i'll be creating one directory name cloud guru amit so let's uh, fire this command i'll copy this go here simply paste this my command let's hit enter so it's um, now copying receiving the objects i'll be showing you in a while what uh, the things is getting copied in the repository i have downloaded the files on my local as well so it's done so uh, in some cases if you write a uh, code dot a visual studio kind of thing opens up if it doesn't open up please do not uh, worry i'll be if, if let's do uh, ls here if we do ls there are two directories cloud guru amit and microsoft so i'll be going to the cloud guru amit so uh, let's type clod and we can type the wildcard as well cd star that we are now in the cloud guru amit uh, directory so if you look here it will contain many files here now right so uh, among this uh, we are uh, just interested in analyze image ps1 uh, which is uh, this file perhaps we need to edit this file because uh, the, the, this file contains uh, the keys and endpoints which we copy pasted few moments back so uh, i have already um, um, like prepared the command so i'll be using vi command vi is uh, you might be familiar like it is uh, we use in linux right um, there are many more things but uh, vi is sim simple uh, which i find so i'll be using vi to edit this file anyhow so this is how the file looks like if you look here it has got the key and endpoint remember we have uh, copy pasted uh, the key and endpoints for future reference let me type i in the keyboard if i type i on the keyboard we can see insert mode right so here now i'll just navigate here please note everything should be in within double quotes i'll quickly copy the key let's copy the key paste it here please make sure uh, after uh, uh, like uh, we need to make sure we can see the ze is there so the ze should be the last thing if uh, we need to type i whenever we'll be pasting thing uh, the text insert mode goes off so i'll hit enter because endpoint uh, should be in different line um right it shouldn't be appended with this now we need to put the endpoint let's delete all these things let's put our uh, okay i think i have missed one thing that is the double quotes let me go back quickly i'll add double quotes here now it looks good otherwise we'll be facing some trouble so now let's copy paste the entire endpoint i'll click on paste and if i uh, let me type i again insert mode double quotes i'll hit enter now this looks good to save the vi editor we can type escape colon wq enter so this will save my file so we are so far uh, so good we are uh, done now we have uh, saved the file right um, and now uh, since uh, we are here in this directory uh, we need to analyze some image so let me show you first the command then i'll show you what it is if we look here analyze image ps1 this was nothing but uh, the uh, file which contains the key and endpoint right which which contains our uh, uh, computer vision things like computer vision key uh, key and endpoints and here we have one jpg file if you note now let me show you what the jpg file contains it, uh, the file name is store camera one dot uh, jpg let me quickly uh, go to my local i have uh, here store uh, camera one so here if i open this so this is nothing but a um, some uh, person clicking at the image of a child here using a phone so now let's tell um, um, the AI 
uh, that uh, analyze my image right so let's uh, copy this command here I'll quickly copy this and paste it here right please make sure the path is correct right because uh, dot analyze image which is nothing but this file space the uh, file which we want to analyze right I have showed uh, the file on my local how the file looks like so it sees analyze all right I got some uh, answers here from AI if I enlarge this it says description a woman showing her phone to a child let me put this side by side to you and check it out ourselves so the uh, computer vision says woman showing her phone to a child you see we can see woman showing her phone to a child probably she is uh, clicking the pic of her child objects in this image cell phone so the object detected is the cell phone person which is this one this this person and one person two person we can see and room room is nothing but uh, we can see it's kind of grocery market or something supermarket kind of thing because so many items are there to purchase and tags relevant to this image see text because uh, if you look here the um, food items contain some text so computer vision is very sharp it has detected some text here which uh, from our naked eye might not be possible then uh, woman is there woman is perhaps uh, this thing uh, this person will be a woman then store this is a store um, this looks good and shop the um, scene or the uh, uh, our, uh, scenario where picture is clicked is a, looks like a shop through the AI right so uh, AI has detected everything so similarly let me um, maybe close this um, um, image and let us analyze some different image and this time we have store camera 4 so let's um, check it out what it is here if I open this store camera 4 so this is something a person uh, uh, one male and one female uh, they are talking per perhaps so let's let's uh, uh, see what AI uh, 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 finds it out with this thing I'll copy this let's paste it quickly on my PowerShell let's hit enter it's analyzing the image now all right so now let's uh, do the same thing put it side by side so here description says a man and woman looking at a phone in a uh, grocery uh, in a grocery store uh, so there's a phone here right and there is uh, some more thing uh, um, right so basically a man and woman it has identified <laughs> objects in this uh, image if you look there are three persons see person 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 this is one person this is one person and this is one person so three persons it has detected then tax relevant is the text as mentioned uh, the text of the perhaps the products uh, person as mentioned uh, uh, one person marketplace because the setup looks like a marketplace products are uh, there in a shelf um, this is a store definitely so store fruits there are fruits uh, might be avocados here is apple I can see um, so we have fruits here uh, then um, uh, produce I'm not sure what produce is shop uh, definitely shop sale yeah some kind of sale is uh, it might look like maybe somewhere uh, sale is going on such kind of and fresh because maybe the uh, fruits are fresh so that's what AI means to uh, uh, see we can see oranges fresh oranges fresh apple those kind of things right so uh, this is uh, what it uh, goes uh, since we are getting started with AI services, Azure AI services especially for generative AI. This is how it goes. Let me brush you um, what we have done. So we have uh, successfully tested computer vision where we have uh, seen computer vision analyzing images where person clicking photos of each other or any kind of marketplace things um uh, like uh, fruits it has detected right so that's what um, the tutorial is all about so let's uh, meet in um, next uh, part of this series so please 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 don't go away thank you so much for watching this video